Oh, well, the saga continues. Nancy Isime is not backing down. She is posting back to back on her Instagram story, trying to debunk the whole she dating a married man and all of that. Come on in, let's dissect. Oh, trending gist lovers, welcome back. The story continues, the saga continues. Don't forget to hit that red subscribe button. Don't forget to turn on notification bell. So after the story broke, Nancy Isimen took to her Instagram and she just posted this to her Instagram story. She said, if you are a Nigerian woman with plans to be successful, please add these names to your plan so it doesn't surprise you when it happens. Ashawo Olosho in quotes and she said especially if you decide to be an actress it's an automatic naming ceremony if you like be a virgin i knew i knew the breaking news was coming there's been too much positive news about me online not everyone likes that once your name drives traffic the propagandas begin with or without evidence but listen i refuse to be bullied by uh, Petraki. Okay. The sad part is I haven't even scratched the surface yet. God just started with me. And yes, it is easy to say ignore until you are on set filming until 11 p.m. on the phone, constantly walking towards the uh, season premiere launch of your show, among all other obligations for brands you are working uh, with and for the future project literally mentally and physically exhausted from trying to make something out of my life only to check your notification and it's flooded with comments calling uh you out calling you out of your name i'm talking thousands of comments like i said since we can't uh sue the faceless account we can at least this uh okay since we cannot sue the faceless account, we at least deserve concrete proof of the allegation laid. Dig it all up, let's see. Not just um, not just a resort to calling names and trying to bully me into silence out of fear and even restricting my comment so no one can see them screenshotting okay, screen munching the same comment for your clout sad part is uh, the sad part is to them they are tearing down one woman but what they don't know is they are telling thousands of mi thousands and millions of young women that they can never make it without succumbing to predators thereby influencing them negatively and exposing them to these predators and their pimps who tell them this is what your role model does so have um okay so this is what your role model does so you have to do if you want to be successful that's how the circle continues i'm fully aware that the uh, media will drive any propaganda they want but i um, i'll do my best in breaking this bias no matter how much i'm challenged uh and she further said 10 years from now we will look back at a time where female entrepreneurs are referred to as prostitutes unprovoked and laugh until then we go they succeed the goal she just she's pouring out her heart okay and for that to say I'm glad this FRA happened on International Women's Month. The bias toward women will one day be broken. Until then, we stay grinding. Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Nancy Isime, actor, multiple award-winning host, CEO, NIP Studios, executive producer, and a creator of the Nancy Isime's show. Any other name and title is yours, not mine and she ended it with a heart now leave me a comment below let me know what you think about this long stuff that she wrote here and comment down on your dreams on your mind on your health yeah you gotta work never tell keep your head down find what you love and excel yeah.